Jarek, we're going to go ahead and start on the pitch as the road to state has begun by district round of the high school soccer playoffs. Let's get right to it. We'll start in big red country class 5A. The Bel Air Highlanders undefeated in district play looking to carry that into the playoffs against Chapin off a run of possession here. The Highlanders would crack the deadlock. Sebastian the gone with the pinpoint cross and Ruben Espraza buries it off with the header. Celebrations all around on this one, but it would be the first of many more to come. Here comes Manuel Rios. Manuel one on one money with that one Highlanders go on to defeat Chapin in a shutout five to nil they they're moving on to the area around we'll stay in big red country because on the girls side it was once again Chapin taking on Bel Air double header in the valley today Huskies with all the possession and opportunities finally capitalizing about the 30th minute to take a one to nothing lead Bel Air trying to even it up here it's Nicole Morales on the run takes the shot but uh, nothing doing on that one as Chapin would go on to win this one by a final score of two to one. Staying in 5A, Del Valle leading Canetillo two to nothing, but they were relentless on the attack. Na Natalia Garcia with the shot, but Nayet Lara comes up big with the save, and Stacy Melendez clears it, but Demarius Cisneros says, why not me from the outside, the 18, but Lara again stops it, but then Yesenia Cisneros waiting to pounce, and she does just that. There's only so much Lara could have done on that. Conquistadores go on to win six to nil. We'll next head to El Paso High, the Tigers hosting the Knights from Hanks, and early on it was all Tigers. Tessa O'Neill with the speed to get through, and yeah, sets it up with the cross and the finish right there. Can't defend that. The El Paso Tigers go on to win big, 12 to 1. In Class 6A, it was the Franklin Cougars hosting the Midland Bulldogs in the second half. Franklin up 1 to 0. Midland looking for the equalizer on the attack, but Franklin goalkeeper Lauren Rosen says no, nope, not today. Then later, Midland going to get another look right here, but that shot off the post. Then late in the match, last ditch effort for the Bulldogs, but Rosen right on it. Just the one goal is all the Cougars would need in this one. Five district champions. Franklin gets the win over Midland by a final score of one to nil. Other scores on the boys' side in Class 6A. Eastlake is moving on as they took down San Angelo Central 3-1. to one. Pebble Hills defeated Odessa Permian 2-0. to nil. And El Dorado takes care of business against Midland Legacy. They got the win in PKs in that one. Franklin wins over Midland High, also in PKs. Then in Class 5A, it was Andrus over Hanks 4 to nil. Also got to mention in 4A, Riverside, San Lazario, both squads moving on after big time wins today. In the girls' side of things, in 6A, Eastwood falls to San Angelo Central, and Montwood also comes out on the losing end to Friendship. Other final score to mention in 5A, Andrus shuts out Ysleta. Look at more scores for you. Got them all right now at KVIA.com. While well, the latest now on NMC.